Uh, the snow has been having a hard time sticking to the roads anyhow because of that heat we had yesterday. But there's still some snow showing up out there. It's starting to dissipate, but there's still some snow showers popping up here on HD Doppler, mostly up in Baltimore and Hartford counties. As we go through the next couple of hours, most of this will go away. It'll taper off to maybe just drizzle or snow flurries out there. So things are going to settle down as we head into tomorrow morning. We could see some fog develop, though, overnight tonight. Uh, the dew points are in the same range as the actual temperatures. Whenever that happens, you wind up with a little bit of fog. But that's also going to keep the temperatures above freezing. So we won't, uh, I don't think, have too much of a problem with ice, except maybe back into the mountains. We'll start out tomorrow morning, I believe, with some dry weather. This is our future cast for 7 o'clock in the morning tomorrow. But things are going to change pretty quickly. Storm system, another one, this is the second part of this storm, is going to develop off the coast during the day tomorrow. And watch what happens as we head into the afternoon and evening hours. Precipitation comes back at us. I think initially... It'll be mostly rain as the temperatures will sneak into the low 40s tomorrow afternoon. But tomorrow night as the storm deepens offshore, that cold air will start to work back in behind it. And I think as the storm pulls away going into late uh, tomorrow night and into Monday morning, it will briefly change over to snow again across the I-95 corridor. So there might be a little bit of snow if you're up early Monday morning for the commute and there could be some minor accumulations again on the back side of the storm. The best chance for an accumulating snow will be on the eastern shore because that'll be closer to the area of low pressure off the coast. But I uh, wouldn't be surprised if another dusting perhaps developed around Baltimore as we head uh, into tomorrow night and Monday morning. And the temperatures will be a little colder at that time as well, perhaps dropping uh, down close to freezing. So keep that in mind for early Monday morning. Forecast for tonight then, raised snow showers will be coming to an end over the next hour or so. Some fog is possible. We're counting it down to the beginning of spring. The equinox is at 1230 tomorrow morning, so just uh, about two hours from now. Temperatures holding steady in the mid 30s during the day tomorrow. The first full day of spring or almost full full day, mostly cloudy in the morning, then a chance for some light rain or snow in the afternoon and then some snow possible overnight going into Monday morning. The high temperatures well above freezing upper 30s and low 40s. Seven day forecast stacks up like this early Monday morning. There could be a little bit of snow, then it should clear up in the afternoon with a high near 48 and then the nice weather comes back The spring like weather Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday with sunshine. Temperature will get uh, eventually up close to 70, I think, by the end of next week.